The highest single-day record of new positive COVID-19 cases is being reported by the Hawaii Department of Health today at 207. Approximately 114 of these cases are the result of delayed reporting over the weekend as a result of private clinical laboratory reporting issues. Of the 207 cases reported today, 198 are on Oahu, 7 are on Maui, and 2 are on Hawaii Island. Many beaches on Oahu were crowded as they were before the COVID outbreak. Here on Maui, Little Beach in McKenna was reportedly less crowded than normal, but state health officials say this was likely the result of social media postings that suggested law enforcement would be on scene to break up so-called drum circles. DLNR Division of State Parks Maui Superintendent Larry Pacheco comments. You know, and sometimes we have people, prior to the COVID, we had people, close to 500 people on the beach. Now, um, with the travel restrictions, the numbers will be a lot sh smaller, but the gatherings, the violation of the uh, governor's proclamation, the mayor's um, you know, rules and guidelines set for, th for the, the protection of the public, you'll see that it's violated. Nobody's wearing masks. Everybody's just congregating. And um, again, it's like a free-for-all. Health investigators have traced at least one case in a person who recently attended a drum circle, with an estimated 100 people on the beach for sunset at McKenna and the rising of a full moon. Health officials say they did not witness any masks being used, and there appeared to be little, if any, physical distancing between groups. The DLNR Division of Conservation and Resource Enforcement reports receiving numerous complaints over the weekend of people, particularly in state parks, not abiding by state and county rules. State health officials continue to encourage the public to wear a mask, physically distance, wash hands frequently, and stay home if sick.